Hello friends, welcome to my channel. This is Charan. In this video, I will show you how to publish PHP project on a remote server of Linux hosting. Before publish the PHP project on a remote server, let's check my domain wpcharan.com. When I open my website, I got the HTTP error 4034 which means I have not uploaded any files in the root directory of my domain. Let's log into my Bluehost cPanel account. We'll check the directory. I'm logging to my Bluehost cPanel account. I just logged into my Bluehost cPanel. Come to the bottom, the files file manager. the file manager notice the public underscore html this one public underscore html folder is the root directory in this root directory the directory is totally empty that's why when i try to open my website i'm getting http 403 error let's publish my php files in this public underscore html folder Right now I am on Notepad++ and this Notepad++ contains a small HTML file code and the file name is the index.php. Let's save this file and I have saved this index.php on my local drive E. Now I am uploading this page. Let's open the FileZilla FTP client. It will transfer my index.php file from local PC to the remote site. I just opened the FileZilla FTP client. To connect the Bluehost to FileZilla, click Open Site Manager. In the General tab, your website name wpcharan.com. The port number is 21. The protocol type is Choose FTP, this one. And the encryption, use only plain FTP, insecure one. And the logon type, choose normal. And the username and password are the FTP user account of your Bluehost. My user FTP account is this one. And the password is connect. Okay. And here we got our message successful. So we are connected to the remote site successfully. Now it's time to upload files into my HTTP directory. So the file name is e notepad plus plus. And this is a folder publish hyphen PHP, which contains my index.php. So I'm adding double click the file. The file is transferred to my remote site. See here, all files have been successfully transferred. Let's flip over to my Bluehost cPanel. We'll refresh the root folder HTTP directory. Now I'm back to file manager, public underscore HTML folder. I'm reloading the folder. See here we got index.php file. Now it's time to test my website is opening or not on a browser. I'm reloading the browser so now here we got our index.php file that's it if you like this video please leave your valuable comment share this video and please subscribe my channel catch you on my upcoming videos